Hey Gunners Nexus fans, you won't believe the explosive news we have today. This could change everything for Arsenal. Before we dive in, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell so you never miss an update. Trust me, you won't want to miss this one. Share this video with your friends because this is going to be huge. All right, let's build some suspense. Imagine this. At the start of January, Arsenal looked desperate for a new striker. Mikel Arteta's squad had only managed one win in their last five Premier League matches, largely due to their dismal record in front of goal. They fired off 61 shots across three matches at the end of 2023 and beginning of 2024, but found the back of the net just once. Frustrating, right? So what happened next? You might think they signed a top-notch striker, but no, they didn't. Instead, they started scoring goals left and right, surging in the title race. Football really is a funny game, isn't it? However, this scoring spree isn't sustainable. Arsenal still needs a reliable striker, and this summer, they're on the hunt. Edu and his team have their eyes on RB Leipzig's Benjamin Sesko. Reports from the Mirror suggested that Sesko had given a nod to the move, and over the weekend, it was reported that Arsenal had made an official bid for the Slovenian. But wait, there's more. Despite their interest in Sesko, Arsenal hasn't stopped there. They're also targeting Victor Osimhen, according to Italy's Tudo Mercado. The Nigerian striker, currently catching eyes from PSG and Al Hilal, has a £113 million release clause. Signing him could break records at the Emirates. Imagine the potential. Sesko, at just 21, is a raw talent. He bagged 18 goals last season and has immense potential for growth. Unlike Manchester United with Rasmus Hodgland or Liverpool with Darwin Nunez, Arsenal wouldn't need to rely on him immediately. Arteta still has Gabriel Jesus and the sensational Kai Havertz, who shone as a centre-forward last season with 8 goals and 7 assists in 18 matches. This means Arteta can afford to bring in a project striker like Sesko. But if Arsenal wants a proven goal machine, Osman is the way to go. Described as a monster by analyst Raj Chohan, the 25-year-old scored 17 goals last season and was on fire during Napoli's title-winning campaign in 2022-23, netting 31 times in 39 matches. So, how does Osman stack up against Sesko? Osman offers a more complete profile. While Sesko dominates in the air, Osman creates more goal-scoring opportunities for others, with higher key passes and assists per 90 minutes. Even though Sesko outscored him slightly last season, Osman's potential when fit and firing is undeniable. Signing him would send a powerful message to the Premier League. Arsenal is ready to challenge Manchester City. Now, I want to hear from you. What do you think about these potential signings? Who would you prefer, Sesko or Osman? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And remember, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you're always in the loop with the latest Arsenal news. Share this video and let's get the conversation going. Stay tuned for more updates because this summer is going to be game-changing for the Gunners.